For the first time, a U.S. congressman talked about his relationship with a well-known San Diego police detective. The former detective is involved in a campaign finance scandal, and Congressman Juan Vargas explained to Team 10 investigator Melissa Masiha why he put the officer on the Electoral College. Yeah, and he spoke very candidly about this. Team 10 broke the news six months ago that Congressman Juan Vargas appointed the former detective to the Electoral College in 2012 to represent California. Today, Vargas told me he had no idea that cop was mixed up in one of the largest campaign finance fraud conspiracies in San Diego history. Former San Diego police detective Ernesto Encinas admitted his role in a campaign finance scandal involving more than half a million dollars. He pleaded guilty in March. Encinas said he and his co-conspirators agreed to make illegal contributions on behalf of Jose Suzumo Ozano Matsura, a Mexican national. Congressman Juan Vargas knew the longtime cop for years. He's one of those detectives that, uh, you know, but for this would have gone down in the you know, Hall of Fame as one of the best detectives San Diego ever had. Encinas contributed $3,500 to Vargas's congressional election in 2012. He was one of these guys that everyone trusted. I mean, the district attorney has said it quite often. I mean, he was a legendary lawman. I mean, it's sad to see what has happened to him. Team 10 found Vargas gave Encinas a prime job after he won the primary, a spot on the Electoral College. Encinas became a part of history as one of California's Democratic electors. He cast his vote for President Obama. What was the reason at that time that you chose him? Sure. Uh, Ernie Encinas has been a friend of mine for 20-some years, a person I had great trust in. He was a police officer forever. The congressman had said he would return the money donated by Encinas. A fall from grace for a man once expected to uphold the law. I feel badly for him and, and for his family because he was such a well-respected guy, and I don't know how in the heck he got off track like this. Congressman Vargas also said that Encinas was actually not their first choice for the Electoral College, but he was the one who could make the trip to sign the paperwork. Encinas will be sentenced in September. Melissa Masiha, Team 10.